After a cancellation in Washington and a week of rest, the Devils returned to the bank in Tempe for a Pac-12 matchup with Colorado. ASU was looking to continue a three-game win streak in an attempt to lock down higher tournament seeds. The game started off tight with Colorado responding to each Sun Devil blow and not allowing ASU to build up a substantial lead. The Devils would head into the locker room with a 32-22 lead over the Buffaloes. In the second half, ASU started to pull away with multiple large point runs and nine players showing up in the point column. With the offensive production, ASU would pull away and secure a 66-49 victory over Colorado. Kiana Ibis led the way for the Devils with 18 points and 9 rebounds, along with Courtney Eckmark, who scored 14 points. The Devils now set their sights on Utah, an opponent that they look to further their re tournament resume and secure higher seeds. I mean, maybe, but uh, I think we were pretty hungry, and I think we still are. Um, yeah. It's nice to play two games in a weekend, and um, <laughs> so we're looking forward to playing Utah on Sunday. Well, every we have five games and every game is really important for us because we're playing for Pac-12 seeding, we're playing for you know, NCAA, you know, we want to host, we would love to host. And so you know, we've, got to, we've got to win a lot of these games down the stretch. Um, so I mean, you know, we know, they're very good. I mean, two weeks ago they ranked 14th in the nation. So um, you know, they had, it, you kind of look at these, like UCLA's losing streak, you know, uh, Utah's, it's who they're playing to some degree. You know, it's, it's how that schedule falls, and they've had a really tough schedule. And, uh, you know, we're excited, we're excited for the rematch with them, and, you know, we know that, you know, they're a very, very good team. Reporting in Tempe, Jack Lottere. Cronkite Sports.